I detect an unauthorized heat source in the lab. What is... Red alert! Red alert! A fire has been detected! Calm! It's okay! Akuro! Red alert! Haku! Enough! Both of you! But this is an emergency, right? Wait, what are you doing down in Leo's lab? You and Leo let me in earlier. Don't you remember? I think I do? I don't know. Yes, I'm here to use the propane stove and warm up some water. You know, like I've done before. Wait, did you say propane? Yup. So eco-friendly. Did Proburn help you out? He was the inspiration, yes. Of course he was. Yeah, since Proburn is primarily made of propane, or C3H8, that type of fuel is perfect in creating a high temperature in a control environment. Indeed. Let's learn more about Proburn by watching this clip. Carbon. Hydrogen. Elemental orbs. Go! The Elamon before you is named Proburn. He is a propane type. Do you know what propane is? Of course I do. Uh, it's a gas fuel. Propane is used in everything from kitchen stoves to power plants. It's popular because it burns so efficiently. Akuro's putting out Robin's fire, you guys. Silica, <laughs> <sighs> use luminous laser. Calculations <laughs> are right. Here it goes! <laughs> Proburn, we'd really appreciate if you could turn the heat down a bit. <sighs> what I was saying... Propane can be pretty useful in several different things in our lives, our homes, and even in experiments. Point of order! Yes, Calm? If you are going to do a science experiment using fire, one should practice the art of safety. Oh! You're so right. Let's cover what we need to remember with Crash Course Safety with Calm. Anything for the limelight, huh, Calm? Number one, always inspect your equipment before using it. Absolutely. Check for debris surrounding it and that everything is connected and working properly before you light. Number two, make sure you don't smell any gas before lighting. Propane is normally odorless, so a scent has been added to the composition to warn you of a leak. Some say it smells like rotten eggs. P.U. Quite right. If you smell a foul odor, turn everything off and step away. That can be a dangerous situation. Very informative. Rule number three. Never ever leave a fire unattended. No distractions. If left unchecked, a fire could accidentally grow out of control or even hurt someone. Yes, try to keep children and animals away from an open fire. Final rule. Always keep a working fire extinguisher nearby. Fire can be very serious. So be prepared, even when you're being safe. Well, Calm, those are all very good tips in proper safety, especially when using propane. By the way, you never told me what your experiment was. Well... So many great projects. An eco-friendly school bus? Reducing the carbon footprint one school day at a time? A hot air balloon ride? Flying high in the sky while conducting proper experimental analysis? Actually... Ooh, a modified rocket ship for a space mission? Discover new planets, new species, new elements? Or the world's largest hot tub just for me? Um, no. So many things can run on propane. The list goes on and on and on. So, what you making? Actually, I was just trying to make some chicken noodle soup. I heard Ella was feeling a bit under the weather, and I thought I would try to make her feel a little better. That's it? Oh, 
All right, then. Well, that's calm for you. Now, where did Leo put that chicken stock? 